Hola, buenos días. Welcome back to the Daily Word Builder. Soy Ruth. We're on página 226. And the word, we're starting a new word this week. It's hecho. And hecho, spelt H-E-C-H-O, means deed, un hecho, or a fact, un hecho, or done, or made. All right, so let's talk about facts first of all. So, un hecho is a fact. Uh, es un hecho, it's a fact. When you're en conversación with maybe a conspiracy theory, you say, I want the facts. Quiero los hechos, or son los hechos. Hay evidencia, okay, to back up. Los hechos, son hechos, okay? Undeniable. Uh, when you're talking about deeds, sus hechos. Uh, okay, so if you want deeds, if you want action, quiero acción, quiero hechos. No promesas, quiero hechos. All right, so that's using hechos as a noun. Hacer means to do or to make. It's un verbo muy importante. And el partic uh, participio, the participle, is hecho. And so that means done or made. So it can work as a participle or an adjective. All right. I do it. Lo hago. I have done it. Lo he hecho. All right. Same word. Uh, or what have you done? ¿Qué has hecho? As an adjective, it means made or done. So, es un hombre hecho. He's a made man. See? Es un hombre hecho. O, por ejemplo, la pasta está hecha. You see, it's going to agree with pasta. <laughs> so, it's going to be feminine. Uh, uh, a little footnote as well. Um, echar is another verb and it means to throw. And it's used in an idiom, uh, echar lo menos means to miss. So, uh, voy a echa, te voy a echa lo menos, I'm going to miss you. So, when we're talking about that with the present tense, it's going to be te echo lo menos, I miss you. And it sounds the same, but the spelling es un poco diferente. Te echo lo menos, echo is spelt E-C-H-O. But what we're studying esta semana, starting today, is hecho, which is spelled H-E-C-H-O. And it means fact, deed, done or made. So what I want you to do is get a great big piece of paper and make a lovely word web over the course of the week um, with hecho right in the centre. Subscribe and come back mañana when we're going to be talking about de hecho. Hasta mañana. Adios.